This lecture on memory souffle has been brought to you by USMLE Clinic. The memory souffle is commonly detected during late pregnancy and in the early postpartum period in lactating women. However, it can also be present during rapid growths in adolescence. This is an innocent murmur that resolves within a few months. The point of maximal intensity is highly variable, but it is most commonly localized in the second or third intercostal space along the sternal border. Radiation is usually minimal. The systolic component, which is typically louder, has a diamond shape, while the diastolic component has more of a plateau configuration. The murmur can be continuous or isolated to systole without a diastolic component. In either case, there is a distinct gap between S1 and the onset of the systolic component. The intensity of the murmur is usually between 1 and 3 out of 6. It is a soft, blowing murmur with a medium to high pitch, thus it is best heard with the diaphragm of the stethoscope. The murmur is best heard with the patient lying supine, and it may be accentuated by applying light pressure adjacent to the point of maximal intensity. However, firm pressure adjacent to the side of maximal intensity can completely obliterate the murmur. As well, the murmur may disappear with the patient assuming a sitting position. If you like this flashcard and would like to have it offline for referencing, check out our app called the USMLE Clinic. It is available on both iOS and Android platforms.